Good morning. It is Saturday, October the 10th. Let us give thanks to the Lord for his mercy and the wonders he does for his children. For he satisfies the thirsty and fills the hungry with good things. Give ear to my words, O Lord. Consider my meditation. Out of the mouths of infants and children, O Lord, your majesty is praised above the heavens. I am small and of little account, yet I do not forget your commandments. At this time, the disciples came to Jesus and said, Who is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven? So he called a little child to him, whom he set among them. Then he said, In truth I tell you, unless you change and become like little children, you will never enter the kingdom of heaven. And so, one who makes himself as little as this little child is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven. I am small and of little account, yet I do not forget your commandments. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Cast me not away from your presence, and take not your Holy Spirit from me. Give me the joy of your saving help again, and sustain me with your bountiful spirit. I shall teach your ways to the wicked, and sinners shall return to you. I am small and of little account, yet I do not forget your commandments. O Lamb of God, that takes away the sins of the world, have mercy upon me. O Lamb of God that takes away the sins of the world, have mercy upon me. O Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, grant me your peace. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Almighty and everlasting God, you are always more ready to hear than we to pray, and to give more than we either desire or deserve. Pour upon your church the abundance of your mercy, for giving us those things of which our conscience is afraid, and giving us good things for which we are not worthy to ask, except through the merits and mediation of Jesus Christ our Savior, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Lord God, almighty and everlasting Father, you have brought me in safety to this new day. Preserve me with your mighty power, that I may not fall into sin, nor be overcome by adversity. And in all I do, direct me to the fulfilling of your purpose, through Jesus Christ my Lord. Amen. May God bless you today and always.